I'm from Germany. Well, seems like uh, an answer for the chat. But the chat knows that I'm from Mahakam. Edwin Wiedergänger. We need this guy. Not an eight name. Let's play the Lyrian Cavalry. I want to play Visigota pretty damn early. Hungry Mahakam German. Hi! God, bleeds. Trian Saber. Ben uh, Sapolsky created Witcher World. He made a Neo Guard based on German culture. So his cleaver is hits for eight. No, seven. But he can actually kill me with the AL. Which is just dumb. But I guess at this point. We're just gonna assume that he does not have it. But we gotta play something. What's the chance that they don't have cleaver? He traveled uh, many years to Germany as a merchant. Wow. That sounds cool. Oh my god. <laughs> I can replay his cleaver. How many damage plus body cards woman can have? Well, he, at least he left up the Lyrian, Lyrian cavalry. I can't really complain. Neo got is organized as the Roman Empire, provinces with some kind of autonomy. They get things done. I don't know if you want to play Vernon Roche here. Actually, let's go with Sabrina. A decent amount of points. Sets up another target for the Cadden Revenant. Plus a target for the sword. But we don't have to play Vernon here. Aren't they simulating them? Oh, we're gonna lock that. Other cultures? Oh, but... I got the impression that Nilfgaard doesn't really care for the local po culture. They are more likely to replace it. Trust me, Germany was organized much better in the 20th century than Italy. I think we all heard about that. Wait, what? What the fuck is this? I, I didn't even know that luck is actually worse than damage in all ways because if I kill this thing it somehow I locked it and it's still on the board 
lock, what a rookie mistake. Yes, I should have just had, like, fucking nuke it. I guess I'm just stupid. It makes sense that lock is just completely useless. Purified does it as well. Yeah. Makes sense. Just just have damage do everything. Uh, you don't you don't want uh, uh, like any control in the game. You just want dead or alive. And anything in between is just pathetic. Anything has an ability is just pathetic. Just and just you know units should be like either vanilla, have new ability or just have damage. Anything is be in between is just like fucking joke. Come on. Uh, so I want an extra archer. This is not terribly good. And this is not a great hand. Uh, nine. I guess we're gonna keep it. I think that's actually nice. Lock shouldn't be too strong. It's for turning off enemy engines. Yes, but then lock should be stronger. Because currently you give up like... Two free points just to have a lock, and uh, the engines are actually struggling as well because they just get killed on the spot. But damage cards actually don't give up two free points. Imagine if the damage cards gave up two free points. That would be crazy, right? If anything, the damage cards tend to be a little bit overstated. Pitiful. Well, sorry guys. I'm not sure what else we could have done. Could have we killed it? And that's not really the deck I'm running. Oh, <gasps> so Ultimately, the meta very much turned out the same way as it was in the previous patch. And before the Crimson Curse. This is kind of useless. Actually, we should play this after 8 in order to use up all the charges. That makes the most sense. That's a uh, target for the Cadman Revenant. You know what I don't like? It's the 20 points play that almost every player, every leader has now. Not exactly accurate. Does he have a way to kill it? Because if not, I might want to uh, shut down Sursa. Or maybe copy it. Probably shut it down. It only squared our units, right? Harmony. Yeah, only squared our units. Maybe we're just gonna keep it. Like, there's no way he's gonna kill it, right? Dagger, Dagger plus Harald, Woodland plus Azrael. Oh, never mind that. We lost one point. Uh, maybe we can gain some value generation. Bye bye. Nice. Good question. Considering... I kill that. And damage Vernon. Over the charge.
So this way, he cannot use the big tree to kill any of these except the, Ar the Arathusa in the back. That's not great. I can copy that to gain a reasonable amount of points. And if I don't act now... Probably gonna punish me. So do I want 9 points or do I want 2 cards from the deck? I think we want 9 points for sure. This is damn annoying. Okay, I guess we gotta play. Oh, he has another Broccolon Watcher. Okay, Windham Watcher gets played in the back. And I guess we can damage the Brock. Well, actually, it doesn't matter now. Maybe we damage Vernon Roche. Good old Gwent when anything was not important just because coin flip and card advantage. That's not true. Probably has the big tree. But maybe we should play Prince Villain later. Uh, we copy Ida. Damn comp. We boost the guy that has a shield on it. And uh, maybe he hit Vernon, doesn't matter. He's gonna kill my Alchemist. He's gonna suck. Wait, what? He played this long to play Milva? We gotta kill that. So this way he cannot kill Alchemist with the big tree. Mm, big tree is gonna be enough. If he doesn't have the big tree, then we're good. Big tree or nothing. Get past. Oh. That was too close. But yeah, well played. Woo! So, we managed to win, but it was a very awkward game. GG. We got here. <gasps> Arrakis Queen, finally! Maybe I can just zap everything down and he's gonna cry. Actually, we don't want to play that round, but... So, I want to get control over the game. Dana is cool. Ice is cool. I don't know about ice. Probably she would help now. Why did you play it there? Do you love to get murdered? He played into, into the trebuchet row. I want to play against some spiders.
Does it really matter who, who takes round one here? I kind of like our doll. You can scale his power in, in the deck builder. Mm. I don't have lock. Ah, Margarita, some of us eat the Greta Gemone. That's kind of good. Well, this guy's playing nothing. Not a damn thing. Is Vincent Mice gonna be helpful? Pass? Like, what are you gonna do? Let's just pass. This is the only, only person I've met in like two hours, kind of two hours, that didn't try to like strong guard me round one. Margarita son. <laughs> yep. Okay. But. Most likely he wants a long round three. And even like this he gotta he gotta play something. He prob probably can do it. Still, that that's a fairly important card he ended up playing. And I actually prefer going first. How about that? That's usually my jam. I, I go first, I'm gonna snipe down all the little one, one dudes. And then he's gonna cry. That's the plan. Seems like a better card again. Isn't that like a 4? He's gonna gain plus 1 point, but also I'm gonna gain plus 1 point, so he should play 1 spider. Yeah, that's well done. Decent. And, uh, actually, he didn't need to do that. Because his guy ticks at the end of the round. Well, I hope. Well, he shouldn't listen to me. <laughs> I'm giving him the crappiest tips. Is this gonna be useful, Vincent Mice? I suppose more useful than Prince Willem. Oh, that's the one we need. This is just pretty good stuff. Uh, yeah. Oh fuck, we gotta throw away something. I guess we're gonna throw away Prince, uh, Vincent Nice. I don't think that's a mistake. He mostly have weak weaklings. And his one big dude is gonna be boosted. Yeah, we don't want the archer. Oh, that could be awesome. There's some still some good cards in there. Mm. Well, I guess we're gonna use the Cadman Revenants here. Ah. Alright guys! I just kill everything. Annoying. But I guess we're gonna kill it. Kill them all! Yeah. Oh, let's boost them. The one that has more points.
We need the Catwin Beat again, girls. Ready. Why do you have hentai dubbing? You love it. You know you do. The only question is why you don't. Oh, alt here. Okay, let's just play the Catwin Beat again, girl. My voice is hentai. Oh, what? This deck is more controlling than I expected it to be. Okay. I can just boost my own guys. <laughs> I guess that's it. It can be really intimidating to go up against the Hansold. Hansold goes first, puts down three archers. GG.